All right, all right, guys. Welcome to React and Chill. On this channel, there's two things that I like to do. That's React and Chill. And if you like those things, make sure you like and subscribe. Going to be reacting and chilling to some Angelina Jordan. This is Bad Valentine, a new release. I've heard this song before, as uh, I think you guys saw that as well, as a performance of her and Toby Gad together. This is the official music video, from what I understand. Okay. First time checking this out. So we're going to listen to it. Obviously going to give some commentary on the music, what we think of it, and uh, the music video itself. Sure. Uh, let's go ahead and put it on the screen. And, well, let's get into it. Let's do it, right? Stood you up on Valentine, gave you no reason why. Decided I cut you off without a tear in my eye. I had to hide when I like saw the you on some table for two. I knew I'd never see the sun shine with you. I spent my night with the moon I thought I told you I would miss a Okay. Bad Valentine. Written by Angelina Jordan, Charlotte, Jane, Toby Gad. Okay. All right. Is there anything else? Any other hidden frame or anything? I am notorious for stopping too early. <laughs> oh, don't ask my wife about that. Hey. I joke a lot on this channel. Mostly self-deprecating. Okay, so what do I think about this? Well, I thought the music... Hold on. I, I have something good to say and something uh, that hopefully you guys don't have any problem with, but I have to say it. I thought the singing was great. I thought Angelina Jordan's voice was fantastic. Phenomenal, even. Uh, what she does with her voice, the way she's able to... Uh, like, I don't know. I'm not a vocal coach. I can't get into the little details, but I can hear it as a layman. I can hear it that she's... The little modulation she does with the voice uh, is just really great. I like how she's able to deep 
to dig low when she needs to and change up the um, just just change up her voice give it that texture that's needed for certain parts for certain words to really emphasize certain areas uh, certain things like for example the bad valentine you know it, it's like in the way she sings that it comes off as if like he oh She's not shameful about it. She's not guilty of it. It's just a matter of fact, and it is that. It's almost like, yeah. <laughs> it's almost like, not even really confessing it. It's just, it's almost like, just rolls off like her tongue very cool. Like, and even the way she comes off in the music video, not really making eye contact with the camera, kind of looking away, uh, shifting away at times as if she, it fits the theme of the song, fits the lyrics and, and all that. So, all that is good. The music video is cool. It's very minimalist and simple. Keep it that way. That's nice. It's just Angelina Jordan chilling in that car. That car is pretty pretty cool, man. Um, I like what was going on there. Uh, what she was wearing compliments the, the, the colors. The colors of everything complement each other very well. I noticed that as well. The red car. And you notice that her outfit itself has mostly... Uh, you have like blue jeans and white and... I think with blue stripes, kind of a dark hoodie, I guess. Like, duller tones compared to the car. And then, of course, she has some red on the belt and on her nails. Okay. thing we got to talk about is the thing that's probably happening right now in this reaction. Is the music too loud? Is the music, the backing music too loud? Now, here's the thing. I like the backing music. I like what's happening. It's very full. There's a lot more going on in this. And I listened to the Angelina Jordan's uh, pr previous stuff. And, you know, she had some uh, different styles and stuff kind of in the background. But it was it was more low-key, and the focus was more on, on Angelina Jordan's voice. I felt like in this, there's parts where the music almost like, guys, may not like this. Might, might not like the way I say this. I'm going to try to frame it carefully, okay? It seems at times that the voice and the music are like competing for who who gets like the spotlight, you know, who gets the main focus there. Maybe I'm the only one who feels that way. And it's not yeah, it's a criticism, but it's it's not saying the song's bad. The song's not bad. It's a good song. I like what's going on here. Um and the music's not bad either. Oh, we got a spider. We got we record these live. We have a spider on the freaking desk. Oh, gotta 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 move that out there. I stream in a shed now. I need spiders to take care of these bugs. Anyway, the music. I like what's going on. It's very full. The violins. There, there's a little bit of a piano. When I first heard this, I thought it was really just a piano and Angelina Jordan. Right. I think I think there might have been another. There might have been a string. I think I don't remember exactly. But this was much more full. And I think if it was turned down just a bit, maybe I'm being overly picky. Maybe I'm making a, a problem where there isn't one. I don't know. It could be. could be. I, how do y'all feel about it? Um, but overall, it is a great song. It's a very phenomenal singing from Angelina Jordan. And um, yeah, yeah, really cool. I liked it. I like what I heard here. With that said, um. You guys take it easy and have a good one.